Hello and welcome back here on Assetto Corsa. As you can see, the Street S15 is sitting in some snow. So we recently just got hit with a lot of snow here where I live. So I figured what better way to bring it up so than drifting in the snow. We are an Alpine Rally stage in the snow in a Street 15. Let's see what happens. Make sure you guys follow me on all social media. All of which are found in the description box below. So like I said, we are on street tires. We are on the Alpine Rally stage. And we're just gonna go full send. I don't know how this is gonna how this is gonna work. Oh, it's very slippery. We're gonna have to lower that a little bit. Those pops might be a little bit too high for headphone users. I do apologize. There we go. It's first turn in. Oh, it's slippery. Oh, it's slippery, all right, and we're on someone of the pavement. Now we're in, oh, now we're in all snow. Oh, okay. There's much slipping going on right now in this car. It's gonna be a lot of feathering of the throttles. Throttles, like the car has two, no, it's a lot of feathering of the throttle. Oh man, just lighting it up. Oh, this is very slippery, but very fun. Hopefully we can maybe finish this stage without dying. Oh, the left foot brake, <laughs> just a little wall tap. Managed to keep the car in one piece though. Would definitely be very cold with no windows in this car right now. Oh, we're sliding everywhere, just banging red line. Using a lot of handbrake, a lot of brake. The left foot brake definitely helps on some of these turns to keep the car from drifting way too wide. Get a little bumps too. Oh, this is fun. I don't think I'd be taking my real 15 out in the snow if I had one. Oh my goodness. So much pedal, so much pedaling of the throttle to not completely lose traction. When we get into the really thick white snow, it's slippery as heck. Do have a little bit of bite in the front, which is good. Not a good time for your eye to itch, but we got it. There we go. Oh man, I'm actually having a lot of fun with this. I figure what better way to uh, get into the holiday spirit of December than doing some snow drifting. I thought we were gonna lose it there. This is so loose in the front as you can see how much I'm moving versus how much little it's actually reacting. Staying fourth. Ooh. Downshift there, because I know there's a turn coming up because there was a little yellow sign. That is a really slippery brake drag, but we managed to slow the car down enough to get it going. Very snowy. That turn was extremely snowy, but we managed to survive. The trees look kind of cool with all the snow on it. Oh, we're gonna hit the wall. Oh, we managed to somehow save the car on that. That was, could have been a lot worse. 
I don't think I'd be going 100 miles an hour towards this turn. Oh, we're locking the fronts up. No traction. No traction whatsoever. Almost lost that. Oh, we got it. We're getting the flow now. Oh my, yep, you can see how much this car is sliding. Oh, this is definitely fun. Extremely loose. Popping red line. I don't know where the course goes. Oh, we have slid a lot. Managing the bumps as well as the snow. Oh, we're gonna we're gonna overshoot that. Oh, we saved it. We saved it. What? No way. <laughs> I got so excited we saved that that we just rolled it at the finish line, but at least we rolled it at the finish. What a way to finish that run. Man. That was actually pretty fun. Let's see if we can get a good replay angle of this because uh, that was definitely a lot of fun drifting in the snow for sure. Let's see if we can get a replay on this though. Do we have a good replay? Oh, it looks like we do. So we're going to catch the replay. I'm going to get rid of the wheel cam for you. We're going to get rid of the wheel cam. There we go. And we're going to take a look at the replay angle of this run in the snow. If you guys like this, if you guys want to see more videos like this, let me know down in the comments. If you guys have a snowy track you guys think I should try or something like that, let me know down in the comments because... I'm always up for a challenge in the snow. That 15, definitely a fun car to drive. And I definitely love that Street 15. One of my favorite street cars that I got in my arsenal of cars. You can just hear the throttle modulation that was going on in that. Trying to not lose all the control of the car. And we were just ripping through. Check that scenery out. That's an awesome sight to see. Just an S15 ripping through the woods. I would say in the snow, but I don't think you'd ever see an S15 ripping through the woods in the snow. And we do not have studded tires on this. This is the car that you guys could download in the street pack. I'll leave the link for the track and the car down in the description box below. But this car was... It was definitely getting it, and I was uh, quite impressed with how this thing drove in the snow. So like I said, if there is a snow track or something like that that you guys have, that you guys know about, send me either a direct message on Instagram or drop it down in the comments section or shoot me an email at teamevilrabbit at gmail.com with the track link and stuff like that so I can take a look at it because you know I had a lot of fun doing the snow drifting and it is winter season so we should definitely uh, be doing some more snow drifting here on the channel I thought we were gonna lose it there just you could see how slow some of the slides were from this angle compared to this car on the normal dry pavement so some of the course had some pavement so it was able to get a little bit of a grip in it but in that sections where it was just all white and all snowy there was absolutely no grip and I thought that was where we were gonna lose it but we lost it at the end I got so excited that we saved that we saved the car that I was paying attention we flipped at the end of the run 
kind of across the finish line too so i hope you guys enjoyed this episode if you guys want to see episodes like this doing runs like this and then watching the third person view of it let me know down in the comments definitely enjoy doing these kinds of first impressions on these tracks because i've never driven this track i drove probably the first few hundred feet to see how the car was gonna react and well it reacted a lot better than I thought it was going to and then we decided to go full send on the track so if you guys are oh is that where I thought that was where, oh that was where I was showing you how loose the front of the car actually is track is pretty bumpy too I think I'm gonna look for some more rally stages because it looks like the rally stages were fun so if you guys maybe want to see a rally stage versus drift car let me know down in the comments it could be a dirt it could be a pavement it could be another snow circuit turn the headlights on going into that section should have had them on the entire time but you know so I think we're gonna finish this replay up and I'm just going to let you guys enjoy the sights and the sounds of this 15 here on the snowy alpine slopes. So if you guys are not subscribed to the channel, I would appreciate you tapping that subscribe button and following me on social media, all of which are found in the description box below. If you want to help support the channel, hit that bell notification. Be part of the notification gang here on the channel. And as always, I'd like to thank you guys for coming back and watching. I'm Evil Rabbit. I'll see you guys on the track. Thank <laughs> you.